What's up, everyone? Uh, I'm gonna ride something different today. Got this asymmetrical sup. It's a board I've been riding for a long time. It's actually purely Dave Bainey's idea. This is something that he made for me during the first batch of boards we made. It's a round nose blur with an asymmetrical tail. So, round nose blur, asymmetrical tail. And I'm pretty sure he makes the round nose blur with a swallow tail, a super swallow, um, one without a little wing right there. So he makes that in a couple different versions. And writing this board, I've never written an asymmetrical set before besides his own personal board. So it was nice to get my own. And this board is light, fast, loose, and springy, and also a little unpredictable too, given its asymmetrical nature. So asymmetrical board is pretty cool. One day I was hanging out in the garage, just like we are now, and I was taking some of the short boards. Let me grab it out. I was taking some of these short boards and just like looking at it, like how does this asymmetrical board even work so good? It just looks wrong in a way. I mean, I've always been a fan of symmetrical surfboards, so I thought, how is this even gonna work? And I've seen asymmetrical boards with three fins, but this one's got just standard four fin symmetrical setup. So that did, you know, make me more keen to ride it. So I was looking at boards and I looked at this board one day Put it on top, and the tail outline literally matched up with the board. I mean, I couldn't believe it. I'm like, no, no, no wonder the board works so good. It has a short board tail. This thing is mean. So, given that, I was like, wow, how can we progress this board? It's such a fast board, it works so well. And that's kind of where the snub came in. I figured this board was so good, we could get rid of some more nose add some swallow and make a two-sided board. And let's see how this one laid on top. I've actually never done this before. I've never had these two boards in the garage together. Oh, and they match up like pretty perfect. That's crazy. Two. Wow, thank you, Dave. You make the best boards. The Infinity Family. These are just incredible boards. It's, a, it's just nuts how two boards can come out so much. It's literally the half right here. Here, check, out the full, check it all close. It's like literally the asymmetrical is just half of the symmetrical board. Now, looking at one thing though, the difference, the asymmetrical board does seem to have a tighter fin cluster. And I wonder if that would work better on our next snub. So maybe you'll have to take that into consideration. Um, I wonder how the snub fins work on this board, but I'm not going to use the snub fins. I'm going to use these EA quad. Pretty sweet, pretty standard, basic set. And they'll look kind of good, gray on, gray on white. Gotta look cool too. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy the clips. Asymmetrical serving. We'll go over what happened afterwards and um, maybe I'll get my brother on it too. I think he's going to come with us. So we'll get a regular footer on a goofy foot asymmetrical board. Dave Bainey says this one's meant for Goofy Foot, but his dad told me, hey, it doesn't matter. You surf differently. Everyone surfs different. So a regular footer, this board could work for them. So we'll see what the comparison, how the comparison works. Chew! You.
All right, so that's the asymmetrical session. You can see this thing is asymmetrical as it gets. And one thing is too, I found that it seems like the board almost paddled asymmetrical. I don't know if that even makes sense, but sometimes it just feels like when I'm paddling, it's like drifting off or going this way or something like that. Um, so definitely like a super unique thing. Uh, Joe switched to it too and got a couple waves on it. Joe, what do you think? Uh, I loved it front side. So toe side, the rounded edge got up to the lips so quick and was awesome, but it felt so long and hard backside with the long edge on my heel side rail. It felt long and it hard. It felt long to even <laughs> like, long and hard. Yeah. It just, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a trip. I can't believe he rode it switch and did that good. Um, and even though it's meant for goofy foot. So who even knows with asymmetrical? It's just a cool novelty thing and today the waves were i wouldn't say the waves were firing today they were pretty subpar but it was a blast and i think just to mix it up it's a perfect way to mix it up and get some different feels yeah isn't that right sundance yeah huh uh yeah so that was sick ace Rich was a cool thing and number one thing when i was riding it i remembered why i wanted the snub nose there's so many components of this board that we changed to make the snub nose the nose is a little bit shorter than this one. Sometimes I felt this board was a little long at times. So yeah, the snub nose is the modified round nose blur for performance. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys like that video. It's just something that was definitely something different. And in the future, I hope to do a couple more of those. And I got a how-to video coming out after this one. So let me know what you think about that. Thanks, everyone. Chew.